Welcome to That's Pretty Neat with Roger and Stefan, where we discuss neat, holistic, regenerative agriculture. So look at these. Look at our sweet, sweet baby meats. So do I understand correct, for your pedigree breeding herd, this is your first calf crop of bulls? First, first cut crop of bulls. Okay. So the background is we went around America, we selected all the best heifers and cows we could find brought them back, selected the best genetics we could find to match with the cows, and these are the, the, the results of the first animals. These are the results sired by Prince. So okay. these are not the AI'd. These are not the AI'd. All of these are Prince's. Prince's, Prince's, Prince's babies. Prince's okay. Uh, so Prince with uh, all very good heifers. Yep. Okay. Now, um, you uh, while we were off camera, you read out the weaning weights, mm -hmm. and they're all respectable weaning weights. Mm -hmm. They all seem fairly consistent. So there was no particular animal that is step, um, significantly more than everyone else mm -hmm. um, okay now the when people are trying to select um, what they want for their breeding bulls uh, there's two ways of doing it on a big ranch they go through and they at this point at weaning they go through and they select the best out of their 800 uh, males and uh, and they keep the five percent best and then at one year old they go through and of the five percent that was left over they go through and they select the five percent that was best and at two years old they select the five percent that was best and at three years old so they might start out with a thousand bull calves and at the end they end up with the 20 or 40 replacement um, animals by just using natural selection to visually select for what is best However, because these are Bonsmara, you are performance testing them. Yeah. So you are weighing them at birth. birth. Mm -hmm. Average weight, what about 76 pounds? 76. 76 pounds at birth. Now at weaning, average weight, what about 400? I would say 375. 375 to 400. Um, and, uh, and that's at weaning at what, six months or seven months weaning? This would be seven months. Seven months. And then your next weigh-in will be at one year. And then two years and then three years. Now, as, as I've looked around these young guys to see if there were any problems. Mm -hmm. Uh, so I was looking at the hooves. I was looking at the legs. I was looking at the jaws, the faces. Um, and I don't see anyone who immediately I look at and go, yeah, that's not going to make it, which mm -hmm. is pretty good news. Uh, cause normally you can see the crooked jaws or, or you can see some instant deformity that you don't want continuing in your herd. Um, and aside from them looking like gangly teenagers, uh, full of their wool furs, um, they're all fairly healthy looking young bulls. Um, and I, I look forward to seeing what they grow into. Yeah. Now, one of the things I do find interesting is because this uh, Bonsmara is originally a composite breed made up of uh, Africana, Hereford and Shorthorn, you can very clearly see the different bloodlines in their heads. Um, you can see the more um, Africana uh, looking bull, where is he? There's the more Africana looking bull. Yeah. Um, you can see the more Hereford looking bull. Um, and then you can see the more Shorthorn looking bull. Yeah. Um, yeah uh, so, so you can definitely see those uh, bloodlines come out, but it's the composite. What is the combined overall? And what we're measuring for is performance just on pasture with no grain at all, how are these guys going to perform in real world conditions um, <laughs> without any, without any spoiling? And, uh, and as I say, without any spoiling, Morgan decides he wants to be like his dad and Prince is a fancy lawn ornament. Lawn or he is a beautiful lawn ornament. He's a lawn ornament. He's so tame. And clearly the son of his thinks he should be as tame. Morgan's pretty big too. But uh, yeah, I'd say these are some pretty neat little bull calves. Hey, <laughs> you got to do. You can follow Roger at d2gftf.com and also on his socials at Roger Savory Holistic Management on YouTube and Facebook. We are Las Cumbres Ranch. You can follow us on social media at Las Cumbres Ranch over all platforms. And thanks for tuning in. It's been real neat.